always alerting, always tracking. This is Next Weather. Next Weather meteorologist Cindy Pressler is back with the sizzling forecast. Cindy? <laughs> That's a good description of it, yeah. <laughs> My goodness, yeah, these temperatures, we're just not going to get any relief here for a little while, so hang in there. Make sure you drink plenty of water. Stay inside by the air conditioning if you can. Uh, don't go cutting the grass tomorrow afternoon because we're expecting it once again to reach the mid-90s, so the extreme heat will go through the weekend. Feels like temperatures from 100 to 108 degrees, but again, today, Key West, for the month of May, established their all-time record highest heat index, 115 degrees. That's incredible. Those dew points were so high today. It was so sticky. Isolated storms. Oh, hopefully we'll get a little bit of that along the coast tomorrow. We'll see. We'll see what uh, Lisette has for, to show us tomorrow morning when she starts tracking these storms. 96 degrees uh, tomorrow again for Miami. That would break the record. 95 in Fort Lauderdale would also break it. And 91 straight temperature in Key West would also break the high. So we're expecting more of the same. And these temperatures will slowly come back down down after we set records uh, through Sunday at this point. By Monday, look at this, back to the lower 90s, which hard to believe, but we think that's cool, right? And if you look well ahead the next 8 to 14 days, unfortunately, expecting more of the same, more above normal temperatures, um, a lot above normal. The cool stuff is off in the north, northwest, and rainfall, unfortunately, as well, expecting that to be below normal. We could use some rain. It is dry. We haven't seen any measurable rain here in Miami for 12 days. And this is uh, the drought monitor from last week where it's starting to get a little bit dry up here in Broward County. Now this will be updated tomorrow afternoon. We'll get a new reading on that. We'll see how that has changed and any of that drought area has slipped a little bit further south. So right now, or just an inch below normal as far as rainfall for the month of May, but our temperatures, no surprise there, two and a half degrees above where they should be. And we did see some showers and thunderstorms with this disturbance out here in the Gulf. But look how it's starting to wane. But it's throwing these clouds, these, these way clouds above, throwing them over the top. So we've got some thin cloud cover here. But look at the dry air. This is well aloft. This is way up in the atmosphere. That's been hanging out. So that's kind of been suppressing any kind of shower and thunderstorm activity. And plus, we've had some smoke today. Did you see the haze in the atmosphere? That smoke is coming from fires down here in Central America. So as long as we have that that high sending us that westerly flow. We're going to see some showers, uh, some of that smoke and haze. So hot and humid, that's the case. That's going to carry us all the way through the weekend. Temperatures in the mid-90s. And then finally next week, I think our best chance for rain should arrive by Monday.